Hey guys, the air conditioner here, because why not? Welcome back to some more of our Isle Adventures, and as you can see, we are rejoined with our buddy uh, Frostbite here, and I see meat. A little aloe, by the looks of it, and as you can tell by my health and hunger, this is kind of, I need to kill this guy. And, oh, there's a Carno too. Ooh, perfect, look at this. We got a whole bunch of food over here. I like it. And basically, yeah, I was actually like three seconds away from the whole, what's it called? I was gonna just run out and go look for food because, yeah, we're only at 600 health, meaning the list of things that we can actually kill is pretty damn low. But, yeah, some of you guys have been saying a whole bunch of pretty awesome, like, backstories for Frostbite and stuff like that. Like, oh, he was like, like, the ma main reason why he's like semi-cannibal is because, uh, what was, what was it, uh... I'm trying to remember, there's a whole bunch of different ones. Uh, you know what? No, it was like in one of the other two episodes of uh, our Isle series. Like, you can find uh, some of the awesome, like, backgrounds for uh, Frostbite here. No, no point in, uh, what's it called? I'm trying to re recite all of them by name. But also, before we begin uh, maybe attempting to kill one of these guys, which I'm thinking the Aloe, because Carno does, I think, more damage? Hmm, I don't really know. Y you know what? Yeah, Aloe's more uh, bleeding than damage and I can easily heal bleeding because if I sit down I hit I heal a uh, level 15 so I'm thinking yeah we'll try to go for him over there but yeah before we begin I actually have some awesome fan art but I believe it was Romantic Wolf so yeah it should be up about now and oh my god it's frostbite and it looks beautiful absolutely beautiful and if I'm ever forgetting any other uh, form of fan art I have an idea of what I'm gonna you know be showing them off by and also if you you know, if you sent in fan art and I completely forgot to send it in, well, not send it, but to show it off, just uh, let me know what it was and I'll try to, you know, show it off at some point. But, yeah, alright, without further ado, this is right here, all or nothing. Alright, so, I'm not even going to do a angry call out because I don't want to scare him off. So I'm just going to go in, make it look like I'm just drinking. I'm just chilling. We're all cool. And by we're all cool, I mean... I really want that meat right there. I mean, he could easily outrun me in the form of... Yeah, he could easily run, but... Yeah, some of you guys are also saying that I really should also, uh... Pretty much keep carnivores out, like, just so, you know, competition reasons and all that. So, I think he's starting to run. Don't really know, though. Let's check. He he's somewhere in the bushes. Hmm. Oh, Allo, where are you? Oh, I see you. I see you running, my friend. Hmm. Oh, I like a good chase. Granted, he can easily, easily outrun me. He's just like, road runner, and then I'm just sitting there in the dust. You know what? I'm just gonna keep going. He's lo he's definitely looking. He's like, oh no, no, I don't want none of this. Let me just turn our thing off so we actually have a clear vision. Okay. Here we go. We're actually gaining ground because our trot is a lot faster than his, I think. Right? Yeah, we're actually gaining ground right now. Okay. Just keep on going as much as we can. Alright. I don't know why he hasn't sprinted yet. Like, it's obvious I'm going for you. Come on. Run. Run. You know you want to. I mean, I don't want you to because that's some meat right there. and I need some. I'm going to just try to get as close as I can. And then what we'll do is we'll try to let him bleed out because I need help. That's the main thing. Okay, you know what? Chase is on. Here we go. Get back here, you. Alright, so he apparently he actually realizes that, yeah, a Rex is not really one to... You don't really mess with a Rex. Like, normally, if you're chasing an aloe, they'll try to run in and attack you or something like that. But this guy doesn't seem to want to. So, you know what? Well, you, well, I guess we uh, achieved one of our goals or something. Basically, we chased him out of our territory, and uh, basically the main reason I kind of pulled off right there is I just remember the Carno who's just kind of laying over there, kind of chilling. So if we can go take him down, I mean, I think we can actually one-shot them, or at least we bite them once. They're in limp mode, and they're pretty much dead because we inflict, like, what is it, like, level 15 bleeding, and... We do about, what is it, 700 damage, and they have 850 health, so they are essentially as good as dead. And we also break their legs or something, but... Yeah, also, the server, there's not too many people on right now. I'm on the France 2 one. And, yeah, there's only, like, 5 to 10... Well, not 5, because if there was 5, I would have not even joined right now. It's, like, 
18 or something people on, which, not many, but, I mean, the fact that we already managed to find one or two is, that's always nice, so. Alright, let's see. Hopefully that Carno is still here. I mean, I don't want to at all try to make the journey to, uh, Spawn Lake, because one, this is my turf here, and two, yeah, Spawn Lake is just absolute cancer. I don't feel like going and dealing with all the Rexes. I'm, I'm about, like, 100% done with the whole Rex plague and all that stuff. It's just... I, I'm just done with it now at this point. I can't take it. I'm done. All right, so Wait, I, I honestly thought the Carno was on top of there, but no, that's just a rock. Is that aloe following me back? I thought I heard footsteps That would have been really dumb if he's tried to follow me back No, nope, Carno left we made our choice we had either Carno or aloe and Carno's a hell of a lot faster than aloe even so Hmm not really much of a choice I guess we're going to have to go and uh, chalk that up as a unsuccessful hunt, drink some water, and go back to our little resting uh, spot, because we really need to be kind of choosy of like what comes into our area, mainly because of how low our health is. Like, if a trike comes in, we're not going to be able to kill that, hands down. I just, I know we're not going to be able to. And if, if a uh, Rex comes in, because we're so low health right now, yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to fight him off. We're going to have to either allow them to be here for some time or pretty much just like hide and hope they leave because we we can't fight much so all right i guess back to the whole sitting here and kind of waiting or should we make the journey to spawn lake i mean i know i don't want to go and you know have to deal with all that but at the same time i mean we really need food eventually starvation is going to be actually a a factor we have to deal with so hmm I don't know. What should we do? Hmm. You know what? You know what? Screw it. Let's just go to Spawn Lake, see what's there. There's obviously some corpses or something, and this will be kind of the only time we're... Never mind. Never mind. That aloe's actually coming back. I don't know why, though. Why would you be coming back? You, you know I chased you off. Interesting. Hmm. Alright, I'm thinking, I'm gonna sit and wait right here, and if the aloe comes back, then we can maybe jump him. I see him. He's all the way out over there. Just kind of like a little blo- Oh. He brought friends. That's why he came back. Strength in numbers? I mean, you're fighting a Rex. As long as I get one bite, you're just kind of down for the count. Interesting. Actually, they're in swimming mode right now. Okay, I think we can cut them off right here. Yeah, we can cut them off right here. Because look, he can't go back because he's in the water. Alright, here we go. You know what? Let's try. All or nothing. Nope. Alright, we almost got him. No! The, the meat! No! The glorious, beautiful meat! I wanted that so badly. But you know what? This is, this is not really uh, going for food at this point now because we lost the beautiful, beautiful meat. Went below the waves. Now this is just more of get out of my land kind of thing. Okay, you get out of here, you. Hopefully he like breaks a leg or something then easy meat. I mean, we killed him without a scratch on us, but the meat sunk below the water. Oh, uh, so uh, that that broke my heart right there. Oh god. You know what? We got to chase this guy. As, as unsuccessful as it's going to be because, you know, it's an aloe and I'm a Rex trying to chase it. I mean, I I need meat. I need it, and I don't feel like going to spawn like even though I gave up at the last minute and wanted to go to it. We need this aloe. Wait, where'd he go? Oh, he's over there. I was like, how did he just disappear? He's not that fast. Okay, I think he's gonna try to lose me in the trees here. I mean... Hmm. Or maybe he's running to twins. Either way, I mean, that's kind of a dead end where he's running right now. If he kept running that way, he would've been perfectly good to go. But no, I think... Yeah, I think he's trying to hide in the trees, actually. Maybe get a one successful bite off. I mean, I, I'm just like, look at these battle scars I got right now. Jeez. Okay, where are you, my aloe friend? 
Alright, you know what? We gotta, we gotta zoom in so we can actually see. Alright, now we're like first person mode. Ish. I mean, we're actually like more than first person mode. Oh, hello. Where are you? Come out and play. And this is quite the situation of you can run but can't hide because he can easily run us out. Where is he? Interesting. Clever girl is all I'm going to say. Actually, I think he ran out this way. Hmm. Nope. Yeah, I think we lost them. I'm just going to give one last look around. Maybe like hiding in a tree or something. But so far, I'm not seeing them. Like, at all. I'm going to keep looking. I'm also gonna look behind me, because, I mean, if he does get behind me, then it's gonna be really hard to, uh, you know, combat, like, level 50 bleeding if he does- <gasps> There you are. Hello, my precious. Oh. Oh, they were resting. Tired, maybe. Hmm. Well, you see, my trot is pretty fast compared to, uh, your shorter legs, my little aloe friend. I need that meat. That's the difference. I'm not a KOS Rex. I'm a starving Rex. Okay, where are you? Probably right over the hill, where he already bolted. I mean, that would be the smart move. Yeah, I think he did. Anyone over here? No, not seeing him. I'm not gonna start sprinting because- Oh, there he is! Hello! Oh, he's gonna keep running. I mean, I can keep walking and kind of, w w you know, wear down his stamina. Come on, my little aloe. Keep on running. You know. Oh, he's doing the, he's doing the, oh god, help me, kind of scream right now. I mean, this is kind of hilly over here. He might break his legs or something. Are we out of stamina? We are. Oh, that's, here I am thinking we have a lot more. Apparently we don't. Well, now we actually have to walk. All right. Well, if I'm out of stamina, then maybe he is too. That's why he keeps resting. Oh, I see you in the trees right there. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make it look like we don't know where he is. And by that, I mean I'm gonna grab my stamina just so I can do that quick little burst when we get near him. Okay, and let's just get to 100. And good. All right. Now what we're gonna do, now that we have 100, we're gonna do our call out, make it sound like we don't know where he is. Even though I know you're in that bush. We're gonna make it look like we're just going right past him. To the right, he's right in that bush right there. Or maybe he moved while I was sitting there. Nope. Oh, I don't see. Oh, I saw you move. Oh, there he goes, he's running again. Oh, he's running into the hard to maneuver terrain. Hmm. Alright, I mark my words, we're gonna get this aloe. Alright, eh. I, keep, I keep having to like press insert with my chin because my hand is constantly on the mouse because I got a 1, I got a whole W so we keep on moving. We gotta, gotta keep up with them. And also my hand on my other mouse, but uh, other mouse, no, my mouse, I gotta keep looking around. Just, just be cautious in case like his friend comes back or something like that. Either way, this terrain is getting harder and harder to, you know, traverse. Let me actually turn that off. Didn't have to use my chin that time. Actually, you know what? I don't know why I've been using my chin. I could just quickly do what I just did. You know what? Whatever. Hello. Where are you? Wait, I hear something. I heard some movement. Your own weight has betrayed you. I heard you run behind me. Or maybe that was something else. Hmm. Oh, there he is. Oh, actually, if I didn't, like, hear that right there, I would have kept going. Right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go into crouch mode. Because he's going to keep sprinting. And maybe... Actually, you know what? No, that's a stupid idea. He's he's hauling ass. He's out of here. I was going to say, we could crouch our way up because our footsteps are really the main thing giving us away right now. Hmm... I want to try to get this guy so badly, because what's our hunger? 31. Oh, God. 
It's at the point of which if we don't get him, we're gonna die of starvation. Oh god. Because there's like no one on the server, as you can see by the uh, scroll bar. Yeah, that's pretty much how I tell about how many people are, you know, on the server. Is the scroll bar. Like if it's really tiny, that means it's about full. Alright, yeah, he ran up this way. Oh, and... Oh, come on! A, a server crash. Are you kidding me? Ah, oh, damn it. Always at the perfect time. But you know what? That's the aisle for you. Crashes just when you don't want it to. But you know what? I think, because now I'm, I'm a little angry now about this. Yeah, I think right here's a good spot to end it for now. Next time, we'll try to have a more successful hunt. Uh, mark my words. We'll, we'll get something, because I have a few tricks up my sleeve, and I may or may not betray people into, the, into creating some sort of herbivore herd and going towards my lake or something like that. Yeah, it's totally not a trap, but yeah, also, just a little, uh, kind of like public service announcement right here. I'm thinking, yeah, as you can tell, we, you know how we do an aisle episode per day? It, you know the way the aisle is, how, like, we got server crashes and the Rex plagues? We're gonna have to start kind of dialing down on how many episodes we do in the form of one every other day, and basically, the whole reason for that is I'm really just, like, betting on this mega update that's Hopefully gonna save the game, because currently, yeah, I mean, we, we pretty much, like, we're just scraping the bar bottom of the barrel to the point of which we're hitting Earth, for God's sake. Like, yeah, I, I'm honestly running out of ideas of what we can do and, you know, what we actually can do, because if we have an idea, we have to kind of base it around how the game currently is. Like, oh yeah, giant awesome Dryo herd, which I know a lot of you guys wanted, but sadly we can't do that right now because of, you know, the whole you know, wreck situation and all that stuff, but, yeah, so, just, you know, I mean, if you guys have some ideas, and maybe shoot them my way, and we can try to do some stuff like that, but we do need to, uh, kind of slow it down, because eventually it's gonna get to the point of which we're just repeating ourselves, and, you know, it's gonna be horrible, so, yeah, but, yeah, like the video if you enjoyed, subscribe for more, and I'll see you next time.